we're going to backtrack a little bit and start from two weeks ago. Um, things have been a little bit busy around here, so the vlog has been slightly neglected. Um, as you can tell, if you can tell, it's very late right now. I'm trying to be quiet because everybody has crashed and fallen asleep. AKA Cody has crashed over there and fallen asleep. Um, so I'm going to give you guys this vlog. So last week we went to the park and the kids were having this hilarious little game where Grayson discovered that he has a shadow and he has been very interested in his shadow. And so they were playing with their shadow and it was adorable. Grayson has discovered his shadow and he's unsure of why it keeps following him. <laughs> Later that day, Mackenzie's little friend had a birthday party, so we went to that, and it was so much fun. This was Grayson's first birthday party he's attended where, since he's been like, an active child, I guess. He's been to one when he was like a little baby, but it was really fun to have him there because he was eating with everybody, kind of seeing whatever he was doing, he was kind of participating, but then he was also kind of hanging out on his own. Currently at a birthday party for a Kenzie's little party. The pinata part of this birthday had me laughing so hard because Cody is always rough housed with the kids and he like really tries to teach Mackenzie how to use her strength properly to make it the most efficient. Um, and that really showed with her pinata hitting because you know it's a little four year old's birthday party so they're all like kind of hitting the pinata and Kenzie's turn and she just starts wailing on this pinata which just had me cracking up and then the kids were like oh okay. That's how you hit a banana. Here, G. What are you doing? Oh. Yes, Lizzie, please. After the birthday party, we had heard that Cody's uncle, so the kid's great uncle, had gotten a new puppy. Sadly, his dog recently passed away and it was really hard on everybody, um, but he just recently got a new puppy so we decided we had to go see this adorable new puppy. She is so cute. So, everybody, introducing Ellie Mae. Now, Cody's uncle lives on an acreage, and sometimes they go there and have lots of fun playing on the quads, or riding on the Odysseys, and just those fun motorized toys <laughs> so the kids got some slow rides with daddy and then mommy and daddy got to have some fun on the quad um it was a lot of fun open air wind it was so warm it was just a beautiful day and cody and i had so much fun just being big kids while papa hung out with our kids Oh, 
Okay, Rainbow. Hey. What? Just let me get in my comfy Can you spot hang on here to on the back. Off. Oh, of course. See, I'm holding on. Go! Hi kids! Hi guys! Can I turn here? Do I have enough yeah, room? Yeah, you have tons of room, dude. One more lap and then we're done? Yeah, one more. Go. Got it! It was really hard to take Mackenzie home because she could not stop talking about the quad and I want to go on another quad ride. It was really cute. Sunday morning, we headed to the zoo. It was a rainy day and those are the best days to go to the zoo. Not very many people are there. A lot of people only like to go when the weather is nice, but there, here's a little secret. You go to the zoo when the weather is not so nice, all the animals are more active. Usually they're being fed. You can usually go at like feeding times and the zoo is quiet. It almost feels like you have it all to yourself. We just really enjoyed um, interacting with the animals they're a lot more active when there's less people and this one penguin was cracking us up just trying to eat Mackenzie's glove and this one lady's umbrella tip we had a really great day This was a fun weekend. It was kind of the last weekend of summer, and um, so it was a nice little hurrah before fall officially set in. And that's about it. I'm gonna have some updates for you and some more vlogs coming your way, so keep your eyeballs open for that. Um, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.